and roll it. Hi, it's me again, TR, for Stagecoach Road Sewing Machines. Today I've got a real classic for you. This is the Singer 301A in black. Doesn't that look like a locomotive? Woo! This is a short bed model. Like I said, it is a 1951. We dated it with the uh, serial number, but it is not a Centennial. It was actually probably built in 1950. Let's thread it up here. And here it go. 301 is the often called big sister of the featherweight because they're both lightweight machines made out of aluminum. Look at this. 16 pounds. Try to do that with some of these machines around here. Ah! So this one's good to take on uh, RV trips or to quilt classes or over to a friend's for a little stitch and sew kind of thing. The Singer 301, like the Featherweight, is a full rotary and it has a completely different hook and shuttle mechanism than other Singer machines. Although the bobbin in the bobbin case thing is something we're all pretty familiar with at this point. That bobbin in there under the tension spring and then it just clicks right in down here. The bed raising up makes it easy to see that, right? Now another thing different about the 301 and the featherweight is they thread from inside out. Most other machines of this vintage thread this way. Uh, so just don't forget that. Threading is always the hard part, huh? For those of us with mature eyesight, there we go. A little fur on the end of my thread there. Between the toes, turn the wheel towards you, always on this machine, and bring up your bobbin thread like that. Okay. Just hear it. So, this is just some bottom weight, uh, like Weaver's K cloth kind of stuff. Here's your stitch length indicator over here. It can be all the way reverse up, forward, down. Let's go forward. Yeah! Smaller stitch. Reverse. Forward. Straight stitch only on the 301. And very well done. Very balanced stitch. It's your tension control right there. If your stitch is a little... I'm going to get that evened up right in there. You can drop the feet on this machine by lowering this screw here all the way counterclockwise, which drops the feed dog. Pressure controls the screw on top, which will take the pressure off the foot there for free motion, quilting, and things like that. This machine came to us in a cabinet really special cabinet, model 35, which has its foot controller built right into the machine, so you don't have to chase the little foot thing all over the floor. Um, we're not going to ship that cabinet. If you'd like to come and pick it up, it's a little rough, needs some work. Otherwise, your, your new 301 will come with a, a standard foot control. Step on the gas, that kind of thing. So this beautiful 1951 model 301 can be yours right here at Stagecoach Road Sewing Machine. You won't regret it. They just don't make them like this anymore. They just really don't. So for portability, superior engineering, lightweight, this is your guy. It can be yours. Contact us to find out how.